Hi, it's Catherine Penfold, and I am here on the Donna Briggs Show with D Briggs Media. Donna Briggs here with Catherine Penfold from Vancouver. How are you doing? And this is your first time in New York City. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's been so cool to be driving around and actually, re- it's been taking my brain a little while to actually comprehend that we're here. So tell us about your new album. There's 10 tracks on the album. They're all original except for one. And it's just been such an incredible journey making it, um, being able to be so hands on with it. Like, I was allowed to produce, like, I'm playing some like drum production and everything on there, keys, guitar. I've never been able to be like this hands-on with something and writing. I'm super excited to share it. Describe your sound. Uh, so my sound, it comes a lot from the soul funk music. Um, there were just select people that I got to listen to as a kid. And then I studied jazz for a while, but then there's also my own storytelling within it. And if you merge all of those together, it's just, it's really easy listening. It's joyful. Even the sad tunes, can, they have a message in them. And it's, yeah, kind of. <laughs> Neo Soul. How did you get into soul music or Neo Soul? Oh, that's been quite a journey. Because um, I started off as a Celtic musician, like folk music, guitars, and penny whistles and things like that but um even like noticed that when I had like a moment alone and I was writing songs and no one else was meant to be hearing me it was always like R&B tunes and I think it's probably because my sisters were like slipping me uh, Alicia Keys singles or like a Lauren Hill single like under the table so my parents wouldn't find out kind of thing and then I would listen to it like I'd wear it out so from that, I think just it just clicked with something. I think I was always meant to be singing and writing this stuff, but it was just the right opportunity and the right moment, and here we are. Tell me about the highlights of the project. You have a remake of Roberta Flack. Yeah, Roberta Flack. A lot of people have done versions, but she is my favorite. The way she delivers a tune and what she's done in the world, like, jeez. So yeah, as soon as, soon as I heard that song, 2007 um it's been in every single set every gig that i've done you're a singer and songwriter let's get in some of your new singles far away was um an original of mine that i got i'm so honored to have uh amber navran she produced it and then this third one uh, Better is another original that I got to co-write with a fellow in Vancouver, Chin and Jetty and Shalom Johnson. And this one's just like joy in a bucket. In life, you keep me feeling fine. You're so much better. You're so much Follow better. me on Instagram at I am Donna Briggs underscore or Twitter Donna Briggs 10. And remember, make every day a great day. You make me feel